Everybody. Welcome back and welcome to Mad Ferret Studios. I am your host, Pudica, and we are going back into our cozy simulator that is Garden Life. So now that we have the green, we have, well, access to the secondary garden over the bridge and the greenhouse unlocked. <laughs> we have to complete Frank's request in order to get the keys to the greenhouse. So I was doing, again, as I usually do, a lot of work on the back end. And this episode actually starts us off with the first day of fall time. Um, and also, on the back end at night, I've also been sketching out how I want to decorate the gardens. Because if I don't, with something like this, if I don't have the design that I want to do planned out or sketched out of what I want to do, I will be at it for hours. So I have to get... How I want the front lawn of the greenhouse to look and the secondary garden to look before um, I actually get into it. So I, I've got most of what I want to do. So we're <laughs> we are going to go decorate our garden. And I did get part of I figured out how to get part of Frank's order completed. The one thing I don't have is pink tulips. That is part of his order to get the key to the greenhouse. I haven't discovered pink tulips yet. So I'm hoping this fall time I do. Because I would really like to get my hands into that greenhouse. So let's get on it. And my white rose that I discovered, it's still missing. I, I still can't find the seed. So I don't know what to do about that. So yes, welcome to fall time. The leaves are turning. Are we going to be dealing with pests? I don't know. Let's go find out. We do have seeds. Oh, God. Yeah, we still have pests. All right. Oh, goodness me. Look at that. Yeah, that's... Yeah, you can tell it's fall time. So what I've done here is in order to fill up an order, I had to plant a ton of purple irises because that was one of the, some order that came in. So the garden, pardon, is in a little bit of a disarray at the moment. And guys, it looks so weird. Ugh, all the green's gone. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love fall time. But it's so brown and Drab. Oh my. All right. Uh, first order of business for the day. Uh, grab that. Need that. 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 I got a sickle now. I'm going to go try the sickle. So, first off, we're going to go take care of some bugs. So now that we're in fall time, I'm actually curious when it starts to snow how the plants will do. Oh. I thought that bug hotel was supposed to prevent bugs. Looking for the purple variants. Come on, I need pink tulips. Yeah, so if, if you haven't gotten this game yet or are getting ready to get in, um, just, just by trial and error and doing things, if you need a lot of flowers to obviously to fill an order, um, your best bet is planting a whole crap ton of them, like the roses and jasmine. Of course, planting a whole crap ton of them, because once you've got your order filled, you can just dig up those excess plants, and they'll turn back into seeds. Oh. Goodness, you bugs are a busy lot. 
Check over here. They're like an automatic pest thingy we can utilize. Okay, obviously that's a regular bug buzzing. It must be over in the sunflowers. Oh lordy. Yep. plants I have. I need like two gallons of this stuff. It's like we're bug free. All right. Nice. All right, so the latest thing that I planted was uh, dark pink hydrangeas, as that was one of the things on Frank's list. The other one, oh, white rose. <laughs> All right, so he needed the purple iris and the purple hydrangea, which... That's the reason for all of those. The large garland. I got the flower ladders done and the large garland ladders. And I'll show you the pink tulips. I have yet to find the variant for. So. Let's whip out our seed collecting. This one's looking good. <gasps> oh, oh, do I dare? Do we have it? Yes, finally, we have the pink tulip. Oh my god, finally. We're going to get that planted right away. Went ahead and get it watered. No variants. Hey, that's all the bugs I keep hearing. It keep keeps freaking me out. I believe oh no, what'd we get? Pale pink hosta. Nice. Oh my god, the plants are Spitting seeds everywhere. Okay. So I don't lose track of variants that I find. Here is, I think that's the cabinet. Yeah, so I discovered a rainbow tulip, white kaiklamen, a yellow peony, white peony. Pink hellebore, obviously. Wild hellebore. Yeah, we got that. I got a light pink hellebore. Okay. 
And these are just the regular ones that I have already discovered. Oh, that's right, a yellow lily. So I've kind of made the back two drawers my um, purple iris. Where are you at? The tulip. My pink tulip pulls a disappearing act. I am going to be so angry. <sighs> Where is it? No. Oh my god, you have got to be kidding me. Pansies, hellebore, daffodils. Oh, wait, we planted it. Oh, my God. Duh. Oh, my God. Just smack me. It was the, oh, okay. It was the, uh, the other hosta variety I was thinking of. Good Lord. Yeah, all right. Jeez. I'm not tired or anything, I just am. All right, so I want to... We're going to drop this off, this off, need that. Get rid of that. So, let's get to decorating the garden a little bit. So, I'm going to need... You. You. Oh, and on the, uh, for, um, ba -ba 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 -ba. let's go. Frank's order. The flower ladder, you just need the sticks, which I found actually outside in the grassy area between the gardens and the road. And the flower garland, which is here, so there we go. Um... I believe it was the large he wanted. You just need the white picket fence post, which you can buy from Leslie and the wrapper. And I think we needed a few of those. So, all right. So I need, I got some fun stuff. Need you. I need another one of those. That's right, I do have two of them. Uh, I think that's all I need for... you. Grab our garden gnome. All right. All right. So, going across... Mr. Weedington, you're not doing your job. Alright, so here is kind of what I was playing with earlier.
I'm kind of making this my little eco area. These would be a nice little addition. You know, it's kind of a nice little area to hang out. Need our chair. can slip here. Can we slip this one right behind here, possibly? Here we go. I'm gonna get a little back up. Going. Nice little area. All right. Swap out. I'm not going home. I'm busy designing. Lumi McRibbit. That's so adorable. Get to where he looks even. There we go. Perfect. All right. So then I brought out some of the eco tires, which I thought would be really neat to have down. Kitty kitty. We gotta find a name for this one. I name her Fauna. Yeah, Fauna. Pick 
pick this up. We do have stone, nice little bird bath. This area look really cute. You never have too many land. All right, who else we got? Oh, we got we got throw Gina in here somewhere. Actually, a couple of Ginas. I think you'll look really cute right there. Our little gnome farm everywhere. These guys back in. Alright. Where to put you doing out? Down at. So I have three. Let's do. I'm a symmetrical person. I like chaotic organization. Not sure where to put that yet. So what can we? We don't need any of these. All right. So we're taking all this back. all the gnomes that I have. Yeah, okay. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. I have not planted these yet, so I'm curious. There's our pale pink hosta. I'll grab you. Because this is, it's not, it's mostly shaded, safe to say. We'll plant some of our newer seeds there. Oh yes, yellow lily. Forgot we had the white tulip. Woo! Everybody's shitting out seeds. Alright, so over here I think I'm going to put the red amaryllis. Now, the decorations I planned, the plants, I have no idea. I'm just going to start planting whatever comes into mind. I do want to get some of the planter boxes from Leslie because I think they would look really cute in here. That's all of them. That might be a little big.
Yeah, this is look cute. Oh yes, this pale pink costa. Let's plant you here. You'd look really pretty. These guys, they'd be a good fit. I think they'd be good right there. We have a white peony, yellow peony. Did I grab any small stuff? All right, I want to see if I have green hellebore. I'll take hellebore up to you. I want some green hellebore, which I should have more if I didn't sell them all. Yellow. We're going green, white, pink, or light pink, I should say. some wild hellebore. I have, I do not think, I believe I have planted it where I have positively escaped me. But I have somewhere. So we're going to do random flower stuff. This will be the wild hellebore patch.
I'm pulling a Bob Ross. I'm just kind of randomly planting stuff. Right. Where should we slap this yellow peony? I think right here would make a good spot. So now with it being fall time, it's gonna the ground's not gonna make me think that everything is brown and dry. Well, the plants are <laughs> brown and dry because I'm so used to seeing the grass green, but it'd be fine. You want a bath, kitty kitty? That. It looks really nice. Alright, so what else should uh let's go drop the hellbore? We're gonna get pansies. I think pansies in those tires would look absolutely darling. Do you wanna hang on to that? Believe those are the orange. Because these are the wild sunflowers. There's a red and an orange, and they actually look really similar. We have the white. These are the purple. I think I forgot to plant the orange. Or the red. I'm not entirely sure what I... I... You know... I have forgotten to plant one of them. It's almost a plant. Let's get everybody here. I haven't got any of the varietals on the orange cabaras. Surprisingly. So I've only got the red amaryllis. Uh, I have not planted any of the clematis. Wait. I have a white and what's the other one? I have another color? Almost got one left of the bleeding heart. I've got all of the hellebore. Yellow, purple, green, light pink, pink, white, and wild. Got all but one of the hostas. I'm losing track. Of things. <laughs> so I've got all the irises, the blue, purple, blue, and black. So there's only three. So iris is done. One more for jasmine. I got all the daffodils. Got all the puppies. Dang it. I'm hoping, 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 hoping that none of the quests or anything major involves white roses. I don't know what I'm going to do about that. So provided a major thing 
or a major event does not require them. I'm just going to have to bite the bullet. Hi, Flora. Your brother, your sister Fauna is out back. All right. Dropping stuff off. How are we doing on money? And I have just been chopping bouquets and bouquets and bouquets and just selling bouquets left and right to uh, bring in money. No purple variants. Alright, let's go home. We need to go visit Leslie and then we can start. We can finish up. Oh wait, not go visit Leslie yet. Finish up the shade garden, then we'll start the bigger one. I have the the bigger the bigger area in front of the greenhouse is only gonna be half done in this episode because I need to further plan out what I plan to do. First off, let's go grab Leslie. And I could have taken the bike. I forget about that. Lovely. Oh, don't mind Letha. She's in no mood today. Yeah, we got Halloween coming up, so the ghosts are gonna come in handy. <laughs> I'm just curious. <gasps> oh! Oh my god, yes! I've got the money. I'm going to spend it. Oh, that is too cute. What else have we got? Oh, Festival Pumpkin. That is so cute. Who are you? Oh, Freddie Numer. I don't think I have Freddie Numer. Russell the Scarecrow. Oh, yeah. It's fall time. Olive, Crocif, Ray Shade. <laughs> That's funny. Do you want four of those? Oh, we got lots of bugs going on. Alright. Let's drop. We're full up, aren't we? Nope, not quite. Okay. Move you in there. Oh, those are too cute. I have to get more of those scarecrows. Okay, I think everyone's okay. All right, let's have a look. Oh my, looky here! Oh, the pansies look so good, and look at the hellebore. Oh, they look so good. Look at that. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, pretty white peony. Although it needs encroaching just a little bit, but it's okay. Oh, wow. You are big. I didn't think it got that big. I think we're going to have to move the lantern. Yeah, we're going to have to move the lantern. Let's see if we can grab it. What? Can I not grab my lantern? Yeah, I'm, I'm glad my plant is happy. I want to grab that lantern. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's do this. Wow, I think it's huge. Alright.
Can I not grab? There we go. So... Okay. Wow, that was big. I did not expect that thing to get so big. Oh! Look at our peonies. Oh, the yellow peonies are so pretty. Turn this out a bit. Alright. Let's see. Oh, yep. And then our hostas. Oh, goodness. The love lilacs got big. <laughs> oh. And looky there. Are, those are the lilies, yes. All right, I am very pleased with that. That looks great. All right, so let's go. Oh my god! Oh, that's so cute! Look at it! <laughs> oh, holy cow! That's adorable! Oh my god, the pumpkins are just to die for. Let's just plop him down right here. See how big he is. That's his well. I can't tell if he's smiling or grimacing. Or both. There we go. <laughs> Oh my god, that's cute. That is so cute. Where should we pop this little guy? Let's pop him right here. <laughs> that is adorable. Where should we put our scarecrow for fun? We can put him in here. Yeah. Just because. <laughs> oh, oh my god, I love it! That is so funny! Oh, this is too much fun! So we're just going to place miscellaneous fun stuff around. Put you in here. There we go. That's too cute. That's adorable. I'm curious to see what these little guys look like. Let's pop it here. Oh, it's cute. Oh, look at that. did I get? Okay. Okay, I only got three. Okay. Well, that's alright. Do some fun stuff. 
And it's going to get a little dicey. I need to switch to keyboard and mouse. Because I get better lineup with some of these than I do. Here we go. Okay. Oops. Sorry, guys. Okay. Sorry about that. Those are cute. I wonder if I'm planting those. I think some of the newer tulips will look cute. And then we have my one of my favorites. The box planters. I did have it. I thought I had it. Maybe not. Okay. Yeah, that'll do. Drop that off. We still have a frog. <laughs> oh. We don't have a frog back here. Well, we do, but we don't have a Halloween frog. <laughs> I love it. There's a jack o' lantern on this side. There we go. All right, let's check out this scarecrow. Russell. <laughs> appropriate. Very appropriate. We'll just put him right smack in the middle. Here we go. All right, where should we put Russell? I think back here would be okay. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that! There it is! Oh, that is so cool. That is... It reminds me... Uh, Dutch Gardens sells them, I know, Rembrandt tulips. If you've ever seen... If you've ever seen the painter Rembrandt, seen his work. Well, the Rembrandt tulips color schemes look exactly like Rembrandt took a paintbrush to a tulip and painted it. They're one of my favorites. All right, folks, I was going to try to start the other part of the garden, but I need to clip all those, dig them up, and I, I realize there's a few things that I want from Leslie. So the next episode will go in and we will tackle that part of the greenhouse. But yeah, I am very pleased with this. I like it. Oh, my goodness.
Not sure what I'll plant there yet. Something bright, probably. So, but... Got our uh, amaryllis in the back. Our lilacs. I'm trying to think. I don't think I've discovered any variants of lilac yet. I'll have to check the book. But we got our frog lanterns. One with the hat, one without. Our gnomes. Oh yeah, I'm very happy with that. That is so cute. I think we got plenty of Halloween decorations for this one. We'll have to go pick up some more. Uh, probably grab another, probably grab a couple more scarecrows. We'll get some more pumpkins and get to uh, get all this laid out. Yeah, so in the next episode, we're going to, I've got a great plan for this it's kind of open yet divides the two um different gardens and i've got some design ideas in here i'm still working on but i have stuff that i can put up that will look really really good yeah nope I think that'll do it. All right, guys. I will catch you guys on the next episode. Uh, thanks for joining me on this. We are... Now that I've got the pink tulip, soon we'll be getting the keys to the greenhouse. I'm hoping to get the keys to the greenhouse before winter time. I just need to get enough of the pink tulips. Or the pink tulip that we planted. I just need to get enough of it to shit the seeds so I can plant more. Because I don't remember... I don't remember how many tulips it takes to make a bouquet... But we're going to need quite a lot. So I will see you on the next episode of Garden Life. Bye for now.